That's right, we're not lying to you with the title of this video. We played Sonic Superstars. Mm -hmm. We got a tasty sneak peek at PAX Oz over the weekend, and we're here to share our thoughts with you. We actually got to try a number of games at PAX. We did. Uh, we have a Mario Wonder video, that's already available if you mm -hmm. want to go watch that. And we will have a Prince of Persia, can't remember the subtitle, but you know that new metroidvania -y one, we got to play that too. Mm -hmm. So if you want to subscribe to check that out, the button's down below. Maybe you give it a like while you're there. But just stick around and find out about Sonic for now. Yeah, we are ready to spill the beans. Mm -hmm. Beans shall be spilled. So get your toast out to mop up the beans. Oh, I prefer tortillas <laughs> with my beans, personally, but... How do you guys like your beans? In soups? No. Yeah, oh... No. Anyway. <laughs> okay, so the demo of Sonic was pretty basic. I think there was... Was there three available levels? I think there was two. We only got to play two yeah. anyway, because I guess the first thing you need to know is that neither of us are very good at Sonic. In fact, I'm not even a huge fan of the series in general. I love platformers and I know that Sonic is its own thing. It's got yep. this cult following. Mm -hmm. It's just not exactly my platformer. I like to be clear and concise rather than the whole speed thing. But I do wish the best for the series because I know you Sonic fans have had had some disappointments in the past. Right. I know that there were some, you know, Sonic purists that weren't a fan of Sonic Frontiers when that came out, mm. but you will definitely be happy with this game because it is definitely a return to Sonic's true form. Oh, 100%. And just from the little bit we played, it's a really good polished game. Yeah, it is. So again, we know you've had some uh, setbacks in the old Sonic, but this isn't one of those. No. Even the people demoing the demo said to me at the end, he was like, what did you think? It's a return to form, eh? Mm -hmm. And I was like, yes, 100%. You could tell that they were passionate about it. Sega is excited for mm -hmm. this game. And so they should be because it ran and looked really, really well. Yeah. The first thing is obviously the visuals. And I get way more of like a 2.5D platformer vibe compared mm -hmm. to Mario Wonder, actually. Yeah. You could interact with the backgrounds. There was mm -hmm. this giant fish that we've seen in the trailer that you yeah. could interact with and attack. That killed me so many times. <laughs> <laughs> there's all these paths that you can take. Yeah. Obviously being a Sonic game, there's multiple ways to get yeah. to the end of the level, but some of them were in the foreground. Some yeah. of them were more in the background. That's right. So you still have this depth of field, which was really cool. Yeah. All covered by this beautiful, looking art style, mm -hmm. which I really enjoyed. It was super vibrant. The colors were definitely all there and it really did look amazing. We played, uh, it was like a watery level and then we played a forest level mm. and the forest level especially looked so good. Interesting. I thought the water level looked better, but that's, I guess that's just personal preference. I guess it is. Mm. Yeah. More of a beach guy, maybe. I'm more of a forest river girl. Mm, there you mm. go. So I don't know if this is the case in every Sonic game, but the branching paths kind of confused me a little bit. You've really got to pay attention to where you're going. Yeah, I find it really difficult because you're going so fast, yeah. but you still really have to pay attention to what's going on. There would be so many times where I was supposed to jump off something and I would run into it. And when you lose momentum mm. in this game, it is like you are running through molasses, especially when there's like a giant boss or whatever chasing after you. Mm -hmm. As soon as you do lose that momentum. You feel it. Yeah, you the game feel stops it. hard. Because there are some places that you can't reach without the momentum. So then you have to backtrack and try again. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it almost becomes a completely different game once the speed yeah. is lost. Yeah, you need the speed. Yeah. Which again, it's Sonic, right? There's this emphasis yeah. on speed and that's fine. But when you're not running fast, I feel like the platforming starts to get a bit more stiff. Yeah. You're almost floaty, but in a stiff way. It's really yeah. hard to explain. You've got to be fast. You do yeah. have to be fast. In order for this game to be seamless and to be the experience that the devs want it to be, yeah. you do have to be traveling quite fast. Mm -hmm. In some previous Sonic titles, I tried to take things a bit slower and it's worked for me, but this game, I 
you're like, it's probably not possible. No. You really yeah. do have to go fast. Yeah. It's almost like, it's not like a punishment if you lose your speed and momentum, but you're definitely going to struggle if you mm. do. So you've really got to focus on like even memorizing and learning where you're going so that you don't mess up. So one of my favorite things about the Sonic demo that we got to play was that there was a boss at the end of every run. And I haven't played every Sonic game ever, but from my experience and the ones that I've played, that wasn't really the case. So I really liked that. And they were also pretty difficult as well. So you don't have to worry about this game being like for kids or too no, easy. This game is hard, mm -hmm. dude. I actually had to give up on the boss I was fighting in the forest level mm. just so I could like, I was running out of time and I needed to try the other level. Yeah. And I didn't get to that boss. Yeah. So you reckon there's one in both of them? Hopefully yeah. that's Because a, I played the water one and there was a boss there. There you go. Mm -hmm. So hopefully that's across the board. There's a boss at the end of every single hopefully, level. Hopefully. That's that would the be insinuation fun. anyway. Yeah. There's going to be at least some kind of like mini boss at the mm. end of every single level. Because I do like combat in Sonic is really interesting and I do mm. quite enjoy it. Like you've got to bounce in the right place. Yep. Exactly. Yeah. It's not just run and jump on someone's head like it normally is in Mario. Yeah. You've really got to pay more attention to it. And I, d I didn't even, I didn't even figure it out. Yeah. Well, I, I, I did not know how to beat the boss that I got up to. It wasn't mm. that I couldn't do it. It's that I didn't even know how to do it. Yeah. Yeah, the one that I did was pretty hard. And honestly, I wasn't expecting to be able to play the second level, but I had been looking over it because Tom was playing beside me. So I had gotten like a good idea of what it was about. But then I did manage to end up defeating him. I did get to have a go at Oh, you beat boss. him? Yeah. Nice. Well, there you go. Laura's better at Sonic than me. <laughs> Maybe that boss was easier. <laughs> <laughs> so if you're an old school Sonic fan who's just been chomping at the bit for something to reinvigorate the franchise. This game is most definitely for you guys. Mm -hmm. This is 100% a return to form. It is, definitely. yeah. Definitely, yeah. they're advertising it as such, and it mm -hmm. is. The people at Sega are excited. Yeah. We're excited uh -huh. as not the biggest Sonic fans in the world. So you, you Sonic fans out there. You should be excited. This, this is 100% for you guys. Yeah. We love what they've done with Frontiers, even though that's kind of a, buggy mess i love it on pc we love it in theory mm. i think <laughs> i think that's it that's true but for 2d sonic this i don't true. see it getting much better than yeah. this one mm -hmm. thank you so much for watching our video you have a lovely rest of the, your week yeah and we will see you on the next one and don't forget to tell us how you like your beans mm, or how you like your sonics true probably more Pro relevant i agree either either though <laughs> Things are good too. <laughs> Bye.